Hello and welcome back my fellow mages and mystics to the growling of the rumbler growlers out here somewhere right there's one Whoop. we're gonna duck in here for a moment because first off we have some points to spend and I think I want to do hmm I think I'm going to do the cat eyes for that one. Combat temporal adaptation. We get, we leveled up in this and I have no idea what any of these are. So we will have to go through them together. Some good ones down here look good. Okay. Reduces overall loss of temporal stability. That's cool. Temporal adapter. Temporal recovery. There's maxed out. It. I think I'm going to go for caveman because we're going to be doing some deep mining some at some point. So we have farming. Okay. Do we have anything in processing? We don't. So we do have one in farming. So recycler. Meaning fertility. Orchardist. Increases yield from fruit trees. Gather. Increases the yield from harvesting grass, berry bushes, reeds, and mushrooms. Demeter's blessing. Increases the yield of gathered seeds. And green thumb. I think we're going to go for green thumb again, just because we want the extra from crops. So I made some stuff here. We need some sticks. I'm just going to take pretty much a stack. Because I want to do the shovel and the axe. We're going to keep the sticks on us because... We want those, so I'm going to put another shovel there, another axe there. We have a nice fair amount of tools, so that is cool. So we have some stuff on us that I want to go and show you. So I've been tending animals here. We have some animals in here that I don't need, like we have a chicken, a capricali, and I'm going to keep checking on our cows, but I'm not going to do that right now. I built a little bit more in here and I have a nice addition to our shop. This, I'm going to put this in here because to me it kind of looks like, kind of looks like a muffin. So I'm just going to put that in there So I thought it would be cool. But the big thing is over here, we have chickens. We have a bunch of chickens. We have a couple Capricallis in here too. Uh, is this a Capricalli? Yeah, it's a Capricalli hen. So, empty nest boxes. I put them in like this. So, let's start feeding up our chickens. Because I want our chickens to breed like crazy. Because I want eggs. For the bakery. That's the big thing. That takes a full stack. That's fine. So we'll chase them away from that. So they'll go over there. They'll start eating. They'll start breeding. Laying eggs. Okay, we have a path out this far. And just to show you, we have, we are almost done. We have one more wall. Then I got to figure out what to do with these gaps. But that is neither here nor there. I have the roof on this. That's fine. Uh, yep. Let's see if we have 
arrives in a day. We have a chicken in here, I forgot. Okay, I got some vessels. <clears throat> Two whole gears. I'm going to put this into there. 2.1 years. That's fine. That'll last there. We got to do something and then come back. Because I have some more stuff. And they can go right here. Put that one, that one, that one. And I think... Okay, break the block to release it. There's that chicken. That chicken. And a rooster. I don't know how many roosters we have in here. So we have two there. That hen's laying, so we're gonna stay back away from that. I'll probably thin out these Capricallis. Because I don't really want Capricallis this year. Okay, go on. I don't want Capricallis this season. And we have one more Capricalli that I can go bing. So those were what those were. They're decent weight. So that's nice. We'll get some meat and feathers out of those. But yeah, I I the only reason is is because I did Capricallis last season. And I don't want Oh, I like that rooster. He's cool. I was gonna kill it because it was a rooster. But I like that rooster. He's neat. So I'm just gonna carve up this carcass here right next to you. Don't worry any about that. And I think I am going to thin out that rooster right there. Because I don't want a ton of roosters in here either. And we will get more roosters. That is not a big deal. So, there's that. Now we have a bunch of hens. And now we just need to... We have Capricallis on the outside of this thing. Which is fine. Okay, bull. Ha! Got ya. We're gonna take him. We're gonna take him out as well. And we have one copper arrow left. So let's just go. I know it's a waste, but you know, whatever. We have an advancement in arrows. An advancement in arrow technology. We're gonna come back in just a second. Because we have a chicken in here. And with these traps, I can do that and catch them. And set them free. I'm just going to harvest this guy because he's low weight. Maybe we'll get a piece of fat, but maybe not. No, didn't think he would. I have so many bones. I'm not above just tossing out a couple of them. Okay, put one more chicken in here. We'll chase that chicken back in there. Okay, and now we will leave the chickens alone. We have some chores to do now, which we're going to go and do. And right in here, I have a lot of cordage. So we can do one, two, three. One of those. Put our traps down in there. 
put our cordage back. Four. That's... Put that in there. We're gonna put that in there. And we shift and right click. It'll light and then it'll start smoking that for that meat to stay a lot longer. And we're getting a pretty full chest here, which is nice. We have a lot of that, that's fine. Um, I'll keep some sticks. I'll keep some sticks in here because feathers, arrows, things of that nature. So, all right, now, I do want to go and see one more thing. I've done a bit of exploring. So, as you can see here, we've got quite a bit of stuff. Got some more gears, some rough emeralds, some rough diamond. We have more books now than we know what to do with. We have some more candles. We have some bronze necklaces. And yes, I'm going to take the bronze nuggets from them. We have some more flax. We have a lot of more, a lot more copper, some silver, some gold, a lot of bones. Not too worried about arrowheads, things of that nature. And I have another stack of this that I have collected up. Emerald, and I'll take a Peridot with me because I want to run out real quick and see the trader over here. See if he has refreshed his stock. Because I've been playing for a few days. And I don't really know when he is going to restock. Should be soon. Got anything to trade, Rigby? Oh, he do. High, high, low, and medium. So, rough emerald. We can, get, we can trade that in. That's yellow glass, that's red glass, that's violet glass. I think I can get... I think I can get a stack. I still have a few gears left. He has the Forlorn Hope again. And... He wants that. He wants silver. Or ebony ruler. And just a few other things. Medium, high, high. Okay, that's all he wanted. Six days, he'll refresh. I have some stuff to take care of. But there's one other small chore I wanted to do. And there's... It wasn't our harvesting our bees but it needs done and I want to make sure I stay on top of that because we do need bees we do need the honey the wax all of that let's squeeze this out real quick Put that in there. We are up to 9.2 liters of honey. Let's go in here, throw this in there. Throw this in here. I have this set out because, yeah. Uh, take care of our flax. There it is, okay. We have a full stack now of this. A full stack of that. 
We have a little bit of cloth. That's fine. So that is all well and good. So over here, you may have noticed there's a hole. I'm going to grab a couple of that. And let's put this up real quick. I want to keep on top of that. <clears throat> so over here, you notice there's a hole we discovered earlier. It has meteoric iron. We now have an iron pickaxe. So now, this is Swayvite. Tell me there's only one. Okay, there's a couple more. Alright, I want to find out where this ends right there okay so first off this is going to take a minute I want to see how much meteoric iron we get out of these because I want to fill this hole and oh we got 12 I accidentally relieved that I believe we can just put it back down and just do that. 17. That's not bad. And the Swayvite, we can make some pretty cool Could make some pretty cool stuff out of it. Permanent butchering table. Damaged stone overlay. Hmm. I need stones for that. Okay, so I'm gonna grab about a stack of this. Yes, I know. I'm hungry. How close is this? Okay, that is a stack. And let us eat. Okay, come on. I have... Hearty crab meat stew with boiled turnip. I found some crabs wandering around. So I harvested them. And I thought, yeah, that'll make a nice meal. Crab stew. So what I want to do now is I need a hammer in the off hand. A chisel in this hand. And every other block. And the ones that are chiseled, I'll do this because I want to chisel some and I want to relieve some as well. So I can do this and I can do this. Where are you?
I bet you came in from there. So what I'm going to do, for the time being, is just do that. And we should be fairly safe in here. See if we can get a temporal gear. No, we didn't get squat. I'm going to get more chiseled than I am anything. By doing it this way. I want to save up some of this suavite. So I'm going to basically do this. These are okay, this is all granite. I can probably get some more of that, but I don't really care to. So this one, this one. some more of the rocks. I do need more granite. There we go. So I am going to fill this all in and then make a run back to the base to, well, one other thing I want to show you after we're done here. I'm going to save. So we got quite a bit of materials. I mean, I know Suavite, you can't really use it for much, but I figure it can be a nice block to do some decorating with at some point. Those growlers are really annoying. You may not have enough, but I don't want to leave a massive hole because I don't want to run around and listen to those growlers all the time. I know what I can do. I do have one. So this will help.
I don't know why that happened. That was weird. Get out of the bed. I have no idea. So if you want to duplicate. If you want to duplicate, you can duplicate. I really don't care. I don't hear very many grumblers about now. do that you can do that I suck all right nothing and it's snowing so we are going to get very cold very quickly. That should be good. We still have 32 arrows. So we're going to take care of this guy. So alright, we're going to take care of him. Still 32 arrows. Good, 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 good. I've got to get more gravel to fill, fill that in. But there, we have the meteoric iron mined up. So, there's that. That's not even enough to make one meteoric iron ingot yet. But, <clears throat> it's a good start. So, the other thing I wanted to show you is not in here. It is over here. I have been working on uh, welcome at another merchant in less than a day okay we have four gears which is fine but I've been working on things in here I've been trying to sort some things out like this is furniture and decorative this is uh, building materials doors uh, fences gates This is clothes and jewelry, uh, cloth and tailoring stuff. I have these in here, yes, because they have cloth on them, so I put it in there. Linen sack I found in a ruin. Wood, wood, stone stuff. So, <clears throat> yeah, I'm not going to put that in there. Small rough citrine. Oh, I didn't even... I didn't even notice I got that. I must have dug that up while I was digging up the citrine. Uh, wood, beams, planks, stuff like that. Stone. So I can put... This is the relieved. Oh, it has two lines like that material stone. That means it's chiseled. Um, rotten and aged wood and stone. So we have suavite. I'm going to put that down here. Some more granite. Uh, hammer goes there. Chisel goes there. I'm going to put the iron pick there. 
And we have a little bit of stuff that we have to clean out yet. Um, I'm gonna, since that duped, we have another one up there. I'm gonna throw that there and just let that decompose. I have some bow staves and a scrap mace. And the one thing I wanted to do to work on today is we've got to go and get the material. So I think I have a little bit of granite here. Six should be fine. And I'm going to come over. I'm going to check on this. Because sometimes stuff drops on top and just kind of decomposes. Ooh, 12 more gears. That is a good... And we have a ton of flax fiber. And I'll take care of all of the rest of this. Low potential, low potential, some more candles. Some more of these, a bunch of that. So this will give me a bunch of copper. And, but yeah, I'll take care of that later. Uh, this is where I have my... I have some more rope to take care of. But that's fine. My uh, plants and stuff. That, I have some more yellow clay. I have to do another clay run. I have to go gather more heather. To get the last run of the bakery. But at the moment, <clears throat> what I want to do is... I'm going to take this down. That went somewhere. I don't know where. That can go up here. So I have... There's four. So... And six. So what I want to do... I don't know why I got rid of that. What I want to do is I'm going to come in and do all of that so now I can come in put one of these into all of these so now I can do this Actually, I should. Well, I need one. And this one I need like this. And I need this one like that. So here, I can go... Up here. You know, I'm going to take this down. While I work on that. Because that's just going to be a pain in the backside. to do if I don't. So I can come in with a chisel. I can... take that out. I can take that out. Take 
that out and I fall off. I'm just going to extend that a little bit more. Alright, so now... I can come in here with this. Come down one more. here the same way and I can sit down That looks good so far. So what I wanted to do now is I need this so I can come in like this. And I know I just chipped this out. I think I can do it this way. And on that, I can. And I have an idea. Alright, now. Um, this one. need it back on here because I need to do the same thing to this one and I'm gonna do it from this side I think go in here like that Okay, I'm confusing myself. Okay. And get there. There. And there. So I can get that. Okay, yeah, that is...
Hmm. You know, I don't need to copy these. I just need to make three copies of... So put that in, put that in. Put that in. Put that in. Put that in. Oh, I can't do it. All right, well, <clears throat> I know how I can do it. I forgot that I made one. So, I can put this not there. this go into snapshot mode replace shape mode and there we go there's the awning for the bakery shop and you can't get through so that is good now fence I think I'm going to leave those. I think I'm going to leave those off. I don't think they look as good. So, it's very blurry because it's storming. But there is the awning for the bakery shop. I still have the sign to make, which I'm going to put above here. I'm hungry again. Holy crap. I can hear you. I'm going to have to make more food. That crab stew did not go very far. But that's fine. Trader? Nope, no trader. Arrives in less than a day. Alright, so now let's go and see what we have for our smoked meat. And we'll go and take care of that. Alright, <clears throat> I think I'm going to make some smoked meat stew. So let's go in here, put our smoked red meat up, 200 and some days. Alright, uh, I have... Very few onions. I think I'm gonna have some carrots. And some white oyster mushrooms. I think that sounds good. Oh, also, I have some caviar. You take fish eggs that you get, mix them with salt, put them in your box, they'll dry, they'll turn into caviar. So that is a good thing. I have dried red currants, dried cranberries, dried black currants. I have some raspberries I have to do up yet. I have some more rot that I have to take care of. There, and this is why I'm not worried about spelt. Because holy cow do we have a lot of spelt. So chicken, there, there. Or is a tree that's nearby? I need a nearby tree. Walnut. Don't really want to mess with my walnut. Yeah, maple.
I have to harvest some more maple. Just make sure I have everything. All right. It's very dark. We got 13. That's going to give us a nice amount of firewood. Eight. I'm just going to put 10. Get that cooking. And now I have to basically sort my inventory again which happens all the time I'll take care of the rot though a half a thin rot we've got more compost going here so by next planting season we will have at least some terra preta because it is November, so November, December, January, February, March. I think I want to start planting again in March. So until next episode, guys, I hope you're still enjoying the series. And I will see you in the next episode. Have fun, stay magical. Bye.